Hey, Duff here. Cindy's in the background. Say hi, Cindy. Hi, Cindy. Hello. Um, I had mentioned before that I wanted to show you guys this new inflator that we got a few weeks ago. It's a Ryobi inflator. It's a one plus, so it's cordless, and it's super cool the way that it works. Um, basically, you hook it up. Right now, it's showing on my M Super. The tire is only at 20.5 psi. I set it what I want the pressure to be. I want it to be at 40. Okay, because the, uh, well, actually, let's go 35, because I think the range that it says on the side of the tire is 35 to 45. So let's just do 35, because I kind of like it a little softer. So we set it to 35, hit that. And what it does is it'll go like a PSI or, or so above it. And you see it drop back down to 34. Um, but it goes just a little past it, just to account for the, the loss that you'll have when you disconnect the valve. But yeah, it's all digital. It reads your current pressure and you just set your pressure that you want it to go to um, digitally as well. And I see I'm losing PSI down to 33 and a half. Yeah, I think this thing might have a slow leak in it. Probably need to give it a good good douse of uh, slime. But yeah, anyways, this is I'm going to include the link to this in all my videos from here on out because it is a really, really great inflator. I actually saw it on uh, Grind671's channel. He uses this for his one wheel tire stuff. So, um, yeah, thanks for that. Really liked it a lot. That's all I got for you for now, real quick. So, do you have anything to add? Iron Maiden's rule. I don't know if you can see the design. It's upside down if you come behind me. Wait, where's my A? I'm missing the A. It's, it's right here. Hold on. There, when it's done, it's like hourglass shape, like our bodies for a bikini competition. Super cool. So if you found this video interesting, very quick video, please give a big thumbs up. If this is your first time on the channel, please consider subscribing and um, feel free to leave your comments, suggestions, and ideas below. If you're looking for an inflator, check it out. If you already have the, the Ryobi um, charging base and, and a battery, that the inflator itself I think is only like 50 or 60 bucks. If you have to get the whole kit like I did, uh, you're going to probably spend 150 bucks, something like that, because you need, you need obviously the charger and the battery. but. Um, if you already have Ryobi cordless tools, this is uh, definitely a great addition to your, your collection. So that's it for now. Until next time, stuff right now.